Amen. Youth Chairman and Stephanie Oli, Youth Department Head of Christian Worship Center. Thank you very much. subscribe to my YouTube channel. For those of you who haven't yet subscribed, please click on the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for you to be updated with our new video. So our daily dose of encouragement for this week is Awaken Love. So today is Message Mondays and um, this is gonna be 
very very uh, amazing week and thank you for all my YouTube content creator friends, friends social media friends who have contributed uh, their videos to our uh, last two weeks um, of daily dose of encouragement thank you very much hopefully guys you're gonna subscribe to their YouTube channel and follow also their social media links so here we will be talking today about the author of this book all right so the author of this book is uh, again the same author for our last topic uh, two weeks ago and um, his name is Solomon all right so he wrote three these three books it was what um, if you remember Son of Solomon's Ecle uh, Proverbs and Ecclesiastes so Son of Solomon's um, was written in his young age this reason why um, you could see it here all about love and stuff and Proverbs was in during his reign as king and Ecclesiastes was during his old age so if you miss out those episode about uh, Everlast uh, New Beginnings just uh, go on to our first um, uh, week of uh, Daily Dose of Encouragement so to whom was the book written okay to whom was the book written so it was written for the Israelites all right they read it during their um, feasts you know in Israel and um, but we also read it because it's very relevant all right so here as we have read the story so who is this mysterious girl in the story <laughs> we will know it on our on talking Tuesdays and for those who don't know Solomon had what had a lot of wives we will be discussing it on <laughs> teaching Tuesday so, so what is uh, uh, what about this thing that they they have read here um, that they find the one you love and never let it go is it about the let it go no it's not about that. <laughs> all right and then it, it goes um, on that verse also that they go further as she brought the man into her home oh my goodness this is very very um, <laughs> uh, exciting and controversial <laughs> So, so this is puzzling, and uh, this is something that we so we should also do. So it's like the woman courting the man, the man courting the woman. I don't know what's that. Is this a guideline on how we should love, or how can we relate? We would see that for this week, and um, but you could just read the intense passion that they have for each other, and we know that stories in the Bible are written. For a reason so we will go on this interesting topics throughout the week all right so are you excited I'm so excited and um, thank you very much guys this has been message Mondays and um, we would also um, like to thank everyone who has contributed to this uh, episode that we have for today and thank you for my YouTube content creator friends and uh, social media uh, <laughs> friends for contributing. Hopefully, you would also contribute with us. So, if you are a young content creator, I want you to comment down below, message us, and uh, just partner with these collaborations. And we're going to discuss a lot more stuff. So, here, our question of the day. All right, are you ready? Our question of the day is what verse or what verses? Did you like and why? All right. We would really wanted to hear from you down uh, in the comment section below. And uh, thank you very much, guys. And this has been uh, Message Mondays and our daily dose of encouragement for this week is Awakened Love. And this has been Pedro. And join us as we declare, I have a purpose. God bless.
God who was there you know, at some point. It was inspired by God. And there's also this, uh, actually he was telling a story about a man and a woman here. Yeah. And uh, there's also the guards there yeah, yeah, yeah. that he talked about. So who's your, who's your favorite uh, from that passage over there? <laughs> Pero kung kapuhan meron. <laughs> Hindi ko alam kung saan ako mag-uumpisa sa pagsasalaysay ng aking nadarama. Dahil sa tuwing siya'y aking nakikita, ako'y napapangala lang ng aking panga dahil sa taglay niyang ganda. Simpleng paghanga, ibinakaraniwan sa kagaya ko, isa rin sa tinamaan sa hindi may maliwanag na nararamdaman. Ako hindi na makikalaw dahil sa ako ay kinakabahan. Yung sa tuwing kayo nagkakasalubungan, tapos ikaw kanya hinihiginan. Ikaw naman kung natataranta at pinapawisan at pagkalagpas niya naman, ikaw hinihigilig sa paghampas sa iyong kaibigan. Tapos nagkachat kayong dalawa. Ayun! Na parang ayaw mo lang tigilan pa, na kahit mo namang kwenta yung mga topic yung dalawa, ikaw napapasaya. Kahit yung mga red line niya sa'yo simple, Ha ha, with my chip, ha dog ba? Eh yung crush mo pa lang siya, pero, pero kung ang kinin mo parang boyfriend ka lang yan. Eh nakikilala mo pa lang sa kanya, hindi mo pagka siya ito po ang kinalang kinala, pero kung ipagmalaki mo, parang kayo na. Eh yung crush mo pa lang siya, pero pati future nyo, pinagpapanuhan mo na. No? Yung hihingin mo tayo mga kamay niya sa mga magulang niya at magpapaalam na, makakasalan mo na. I-crush mo pa nga lang siya. Na. I-crush mo pa nga lang siya. Pero hindi. I- I-crush mo pa nga lang siya. Pero pati pangalan na magiging anak niyo, napag-isipan mo na. Kung bagay na ba yung combination na pangalan yung dalawa. I-crush mo pa nga lang siya. Pero, yung, pero pinag-isipan niyo na yung magiging bahay niyo. Yung kahit simple lang na yun. Na hindi man perfecto. At least, nagmamahalan kayo. Ouch. Nakatulog pala ako. Panaginip lang pala lahat ng mga sinabi ko. Hindi ko ang kalain ng taas-taas na pala ng pangarap ko na ikaw at ako ay magkakatotoo. Eh yung crush mo, eh yung... Eh. Pero ngayon, bago ang lahat, pero ngayon, crush lang muna kita. Masaya na ako na araw-araw kitang nakikita. Hindi mo lang ako'y ginaganahan na sa araw-araw na pagpasok sa eskwela. Pero ngayon, crush lang muna kita. Tititigan ang pagmamasta niya para mga bituin sa katanika na kahit ang layo mo. Na kahit ang layo mo aking aabutin at nang maging ikaw ay akin. Pero, pero, ikaw ay aabutin at nang maging akin kung will nga ba ng Panginoon natin. Pero ngayon, crush lang muna kita. Dahil gusto ang gusto pa kitang makilala. Pero ngayon, si Christ lang muna. Ipapanalangin na ikaw ay maging akin, hindi man ngayon, pero sa tamang panahon na inilalaan ng ating Panginoon. Kung nararamdaman mo na siya na talaga, ipanalangin mo sa Panginoon. Ipanalangin, ipanalangin natin yung magkaya ng lyrics ng Christian ng Ilag. Lord, ayokong lumayo sa katawaban ko. Pero kung siya na talaga, Lord God, tulungan mo ko. Ayokong mabuliliyaso ang plano mo. Dahil the best ang galing sa'yo. Kaya ngayon, si Christ lang muna. Bago si crush lang muna kita. 